And in the end, it was the defense that led the high-scoring Tampa Bay Lightning to another appearance in the Stanley Cup Final as they win Game 7, 1-0 over the New York Islanders. Just 11 goals allowed in the seven games by the Tampa Bay Lightning. Just one power play goal allowed in the series as well. Really impressive team defensive effort leads him to a victory. Yes, Andre Vasilevsky gets another shutout, his second in the series, but he will be the first to recognize the players in front of him who blocked so many shots. And how about the performance from the three big defenders? Victor Hedman was outstanding. Mikhail Sergachev, also outstanding. Ryan McDonough, I thought perhaps the best of them all. What a performance by the three of them, eating up big minutes, blocking major amounts of shots, owning the puck in certain areas, winning battles galore, and really setting the tone for the defensive presence for this team. Also appropriate that Yanni Gord gets the only goal, a shorthanded goal for that matter, in this game, because Gord, a real grinder. We talked early in the series about how his line needed to get back to the level that they had done earlier in their playoffs, and in fact, last year, last season in the bubble when they were outstanding, and I thought they got better as this series went on. A great shorthanded goal off of the pass initially, deep in the zone, actually by Ryan McDonough, who was a, it was a master class of killing a penalty, got the puck up the ice, gets it up to Kalorn, gets it over to Sorelli, and then Gord scores. So very appropriate that Yanni Gord scores the only goal of the game. And again, when all said and done, the high-flying, high-scoring Tampa Bay Lightning shut down the New York Islanders and win because of their team defense. Going to make their head coach, John Cooper, very, very proud. And for the New York Islanders, well, they didn't have a lot of shots in this game, just 18, but they did have a couple of opportunities later in the game. The one that really stands out is the puck that bounced over Matt Barzell stick off to the blocker side of Vasilevsky. So there were chances still for the Islanders who really continued to show great resilience, excellent fortitude. And despite the fact that on the scoreboard, being outshot and somewhat outplayed and territorially, they still found a way to stay in the game very classic New York Islanders, and they gave themselves a chance. But in the end, defense wins. The championship pedigree of the Tampa Bay Lightning come through, and they get set now to take on the Montreal Canadiens for the Stanley Cup. A great time covering this series. Look forward to watching the final. Back to you.